Yo guys, Impulse191 here, welcome you back to the second episode of our Let's Play Dark Rising. I forgot his name there for a second, wow, okay. Well, if you watched the last episode, you'll know um, that this game is incredibly difficult, and uh, the Nuzlocke hasn't even started yet, um, which is quite, quite good really, otherwise we'd have lost it like 20 times over. So, let's um, hop into the game. Um, and yeah, I made it through the cave. I leveled up once uh, on the way back up here after um, recovering my Pokemon. And um, I got Dragon Breath. So, um, pretty good. Uh, 60 power plus our stab. And we've got a Dragon Fang, I think it was, um, to boost it even more. So, now we can get straight in into this um, battle. We know that what she has to say. And um, so let's get on with this. Let's do this. If you did miss the previous episode and you are watching this now, I'll leave a link in the description for um, the first episode so you can catch up and you can see our mauling. Anyway, um, as for this episode, we are going to maul this at you. We've got the Dragon Breath now, so it's a one shot, super effective, but we're not messing around. Lovely experience, and yes, you're not under a spell after all. I suggest you step aside before I use my real power, huh? We need to know about this guy. Oh no. I apologise if the audio has been bad up until this point, I've just realised there's something with my headset feature. So, um. Hopefully that has increased it now, it's made it better. Um, so yeah, apologies for that. Um, until we meet again, we don't even get a name, okay. Oh, okay, so this is literally a Pokemon in a mountain. All right, a lot's have been happening in the core region, but we've got this package for Professor Ivan. Thank you. Am I ever going to come back here? No. Yes. Definitely, because I need Pokeballs. Oh! I hear one of the gyms in the core region is trying to track down the cause of the sudden climate changes. I'm going to say that's the first gym leader then, otherwise it wouldn't tell us anything about it. It's a Zubat, of course. We've not run into anything else in this cave other than Zubats. So... I guess there's not... Oh! Oh, that... That's, um... A little beyond a jerk. Don't you dare say we're fighting this guy. He's got to be the gym leader. Okay. Whew. Hey Pete, you see that trainer there with that Pokemon? Whoa, what kind of Pokemon is it? <laughs> I'm not gonna battle this guy, no. I don't think it's a good idea, Impulse. It looks really powerful. Nah, don't worry about it. Me and my partner will get mauled. But we'll pretend we can handle this. We're always ready. Hmm. You share quite a resemblance to that fool. Wow. This guy. <laughs> what? Your agony will satisfy me. Prepare to fall. <laughs> this guy should be a strong opponent. Ready for... He's actually going to battle us with Tornados. Is that Lance? No, it's... What's his name? Something beginning with L. Lysander. Ly... What is his name? I cannot remember his name, but it looks like him. That voice from the dream! You strategy to overcome? Are you actually joking? Why are you telling me this again? He's level 50, he's gonna one-shot us. Level 50! Would this... If the Nuzlocke would have started, would this have counted? Is this going to be actually a possible Nuzlocke? Because if it throws me into a battle like this later on... Oh, time to get mauled. A hurricane. Dead. Right then. Ha, ah, what a pitiful soul you are. Oh. Why is he telling me the stuff I already know? Arceus, get out of my face. This Pokemon is too strong! I lost! 
You don't seem to have the potential to stop us. I'll leave you for now. <gasps> Are you okay? Are you okay, boss man? Speak to me. You can't even speak. Oh, I can't even speak. What have you done to him? Why am I so in shock? It's not like I've got a soul link to my actual, um, Gibble, Gibbye, or whatever it is. I should have been watching like, oh my god, it's knocked out. We'll meet again. Teleport no jutsu. It disappeared right when the rain stopped. Come on, Nimbles, I'll take you home. All right, after we got mauled. <gasps> Are you okay? He was beaten down by that strong Pokemon. Don't worry, it's gone now. Oh, sweetie, I was so worried Pete brought you home. You've got no broken bones, I should hope not. Is that like I jumped in the way? No, I'll save you, Gibbite. We've got a strong bond, not that strong. I'm not willing to risk my life for Gibbite. Especially to a hurricane. Um, what a relief. Next time, take care of yourself. Yeah, everything seems okay. I'll be going now. Okay, Pete. <laughs> Thanks for everything. No problem. I'll be on Dubai Road. Get out of here, no one cares. Well, Impulse, you didn't need to deliver that package. Professor Ivan? Oh yeah, why didn't they take it and go and give it him while I was unconscious? Take care of yourself. I think your Nuzlocke's about to begin and be over in about two seconds. Alright. Let us see. Anyway, here's your package. I got destroyed trying to get it. From Professor Oak, here. Are you ri Man, those woods are crazy. You'd hate it there. Here's the ingredients. What are these ingredients for? Behind me are two Pokedexes. I want to give you these days ago, but here you go. We received a Pokedex. You can record some data on it, as everybody knows. And here, take some Pokeballs so your nuzzle can finally be over. Use them wisely. You two have been studying to become part of training since you were kids, and I have been doing the wrong voice for this guy, but it is fine. I'd expect you to know the base going. Okay, let's have a contest. Whoever comes to champion first wins. Let's meet again somewhere. Ah. Alright, the Nuzlocke is... Wait a minute. The Nuzlocke is officially on. How many Pokeballs did you give us? Five, you tight person. All right. <sighs> we save and we go into the route. Don't give us crack crap. Don't give us crack crap and we're okay. Pidgey. Oh, not Pidgey, I want a Mintino. All right. Tackle is our weakest move. Go Pokeball. I don't know how we're supposed to train this Pidgey up. Pidgey is a bird-like Pokemon. Give a nickname to Pidgey? Yes. Um, it is male, so we'll call it... Um... No, we're not going to call it Ethan. Yeah, we'll call it Ethan. Ethan! La la la, Ethan! Alright. <sighs> okay then. Let's um, check out our Ethan. Ethan the Pidgey. Ethan is a jolly nature. <laughs> oh, come on, why? He's got no item. He's got tackle. He hasn't even got gust. Wow. Come on, Ethan. Ah, oh, Taylor, you would have been so much better. I think Pidgey and Crack Crack were the worst on the route, but we have to take them. We can we can make a good thing out of this, surely. Yes. Let us rest our guy. 
And now the grinding begins. Because Ethan's probably going to go down in like two hits. Alright, time to play um, grinding montage. Cue music and um, I will see you in a moment. Alright guys, as you see I've done a little bit of grinding, uh, if you're paying attention at all you'll notice that I got to level 12, Ethan learned Gust, and um, we are going to go back into the cave to catch a Zubat, since that seems like it's the only thing there. And we uh, need to sell our nugget, and um, maybe buy some more Pokeballs, so let's go and do all of that right now. Sir is Zubat. Oh! Drill ball. Um, Excadrill, drill, that's where he goes into, yeah. Level 8. Um, you can take a gust. Mud slap doesn't affect me. Are you a ground type yet? Come on. Rapid spin? Obviously gets a crit. One Pokeball to save the day. Yeah, Excadrill it is. Um, it can dig through grounds at 30 miles an hour, wow. Um, it's male. Um, what are we calling this thing? Mm, we could call it... Um, am I going to do that? I might do. I guess I could start naming my guys after people um, that I talk to. Um, yeah, I suppose. All right. Um, let's go with Jay's art. Um. Oh, he goes with the Jazzard, but I'm just going to call it Jazzard. Yes. All right, then. Let's check out Jazzard. And um, it is holding an item. It's mild nature holding soft sand. Wow. It's like that, is it? Um, sand Veil and his stats look pretty impressive, I suppose, for a level 8. 20 attack, he's got Mud Slap, which is 20 power, plus his Stab, yes, yes, plus his Stab, plus his Soft Sand, which raises it a little bit, I assume, he's going to die though, because I need to go back and heal him, what, we do not accept deliveries, we, I thought this were a Pokemon, alright, let's get out of here as quickly as we can, nope, Um, what's going on? Let me just think. I need to run from this guy. That's what's going on. And we need to go and heal up. I can't afford anything through that next route. If it's a trainer or whatever, and my guy's on like two health or whatever he's on. I need to go back and to heal up. Come on, Mama Bear. Mama Bear, heal me, baby. Um, I suppose um, Jay's Idol um, gain some experience on his journeys. Mm. We need the place for the. We need a Pokemon. We need one to be right through here right now. 
Twisted woods. The twist woods. All right, there's a trainer. I'm scared of him. It looks like a bug catcher though, so Gus should be able to do a number on him. And our first encounter in this route is a spinner rack. Female spinner rack. Level 11, wow. That is a mighty increase. One more and we should be able to catch it. All right, time to catch this thing. Pokeball go, right? Yeah. All right, spin right was caught. Um, Incy Winset, or are we going with another name? Um, another name. Shall we go with another name? No, I think I'm gonna go with. Oh, why? Blah. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with Incy Wincy on this one. Insert. Why? Oh, Winsay. That is not how you spell Winsay. Incy Winsay. That doesn't look right. Why is it every time I write a name on, in a Pokemon game it looks wrong? It's gone. It's done. I don't care. All right, we got Incy Winsay. Let's see what Incy Wincy's got. Incy Wincy has a haste in nature, which is speed up. Um, defense down though. Is he a bug poison? He is a bug poison. 20 attack stat. And he's got poison sting, constrict, scary face, and string shock. Because he loves lowering speed. All right, it's going to be pretty hard to um, increase levels for him, I guess. Oh my god, this is such a... Such a um, mess around, having to go all the way back down here every time. Just give me a damn Pokemon sample. And a Pokemon, that would be immense. Please. I would be quite happy if you did that. It would make my day. I guess we're going to get uh, Ethan leveled up now because there's lots of bugs around his level. No, we're not going for that grass. There's lots of bugs around his level, and we can get some, um... Starly Soul. Dragon Rage is obviously still good. We've got to train a battle, though. I'm the best bug catcher around here. Let's battle. Okay, let's do this. You've got a level 8 Caterpie. Which I will maul. Venipede, we know that you give amazing experience, Venipede. Give me about a billion experience. Roll out. Yeah, that hurts. But 6,000 experience? Oh, no. Ethan Lane Quick Attack. Um. They see me rolling. I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty um, scared. C dot, we had an option of a C dot in here. I've just noticed that my HP is low again. It's a crit. Level 14, you will soon be a Pidgeotto. Pidgeot, Pidgeot! No! I'm not gonna lie, I have no idea what that is. I don't know what it evolves into, no idea. Carablast? Is it even a real Pokemon? I don't know. Let's hope that it dies to this. Uh, it doesn't die to this. It's Volcano. It's got Peck. But I'm not weak to Peck. Yes. Let's do this. 
Do I have that potion still? Do I have anything to heal up? I do have a potion. Take it. Take it, Pidgey. Oh! <gasps> Is that, a, is that a Pokemon Center? That looks like a gym, actually. A boo-boo. Oh, yuck, a boo-boo. Oh, at least it's not like level 500. I'm just gonna keep gusting, because gust is the way forward. 200 experience, Shroomish, that's fine. You bring Shroomish. Ethan will take all the things. So uh, I'm guessing the grass gym leader is the first one. Since there's so many bugs and grass guys around here. Ethan grew to 15. I don't know what that said, but I'm taking it. See that? Come on, Ethan. There needs to be a Pokemon Center nearby. What's that? It survived. Okay. Alright then, is there a Pokemon Center? That's, that's definitely not a Pokemon Center, damn it I didn't mean to press that. That's definitely not a Pokemon Center, what is this? Oh you're, are you a Steel type yet? I'm gonna pretend you're not, Acid Armor, okay, you can do that. I can't stop you. Acid Armor again though, that's fine. I think I might have to switch out of her Ethan now because I'm scared of getting critted. Even though there's only two more levels. That's a Carablast guy again. Oh, come on then, Rose. Time to take this guy down with Dragon Breath. He's faster than us, wow. Yeah, Paralyze. Oh, he's playing those games. All right, well, I guess I'm switching um, my guys around. This episode will shortly be coming to an end. There's got to be a Pokemon Center. That is a gym. I'm not going to that because I don't want it to... Let's just battle these guys. Oh, you did it. You did it. Come here. I will take your soul, Tangler. No crinkles for you. Story behind um, why I hate Tangler. It's my most hated Pokemon. Um, basically... In Gen 1, there was an tr in-game trade um, that allowed you to trade um, an in-game trade that let you collect Crinkles. The um, in-game name was it, it was called Crinkles. Um, and so I had this Crinkles, the Tangler, and there was um, a little exploit with back in the day when you had to use link cables and all sorts of stuff to um, trade you know, to trade Pokemon and stuff. There was a glitch that let you clone Pokemon. So, um, I did this glitch, and um, it was supposed to let me get rid of whatever the second Pokemon was, and um, you duplicate the Pokemon, obviously. So, I had two Charm, I had Charmander, I had Crinkles, and I tried to clone the Charmander. But instead, um, it messed up somehow, and it cloned Crinkles. So then I lost my starter Pokemon, Charmander, and I had two stupid Crinkles. And ever since then, it's been my most hated Pokemon. That's since Pokemon Blue version. All that time. Every time I get a Tangela, I put it in the middle of its own box, it gets ignored. It is a piece of garbage. If it was on fire, I would not pass it a fire extinguisher. No Squirtle would be using water guns around here. Oh, that hit, it just runs deep. Crinkles, now you all know, Crinkles a Tangler. Hated. Um, I think, I think, I think, I think, I think, I think, I think. I might just call it here for this episode. Um, next episode, I guess we'll be checking out that gym and seeing where, what happens with it if we have to go in. So far, we've not seen a Pokemon Center. We've not seen a Pokemon. So it is becoming quite um, troublesome. But yeah, if you um, 
if you like this episode i appreciate the support you give drop a like down below um that thumbs up button's right there and um yeah i'll leave a link to something in the description i don't even know what at this point <laughs> um but yeah go check it out anyway i'm sure it's something interesting and um if we can get enough if we can get the five like mark again i'm gonna uh, push forward drop um, another episode of this out uh, real soon and uh, yeah so thanks for watching anyway guys laters